Princess Leia, the twins from The Shining, and other iconic movie characters all had a place on this brick backdrop. The owner was really open to our interpretation. She just wanted something somewhat film related. The colorful mural caught the attention of drivers and customers of the former awesome video store on Freeport Boulevard. The concept and the content was like a lot of classic films. These days, Sean Berner and Francesca Gomez worked to restore the original K Street Tower Records mural. But two years ago, they were putting in that same TLC into this land park wall. But when the video rental store closed last month and a new lease was signed, the mural didn't make the cut. Under the uh, Visual Artist Rights Act, we should have been notified 90 days before that was going to happen. The disappearance of this mural is getting quite a response from the community. When we arrived here, we found this makeshift memorial with a candle and a bouquet of dead roses inside a vase that reads, not so awesome. It was very decent artwork, really. You know, it wasn't um, like an eyesore or anything like that. Actually, I think they should have left it up there. <laughs> the realtor for the building says the images weren't relevant to the tenants moving in. Land Park Gold and Silver. We specialize in jewelry repair, manufacturing, rare coins. But Jeff and Judy Montgomery say they're willing to give this blank canvas a second act. The same love and concern that went into the last mural, we want to we want to see that exact same compassion going to the side of this building. In Sacramento, Kathy Park, KCRA 3 News.